and we're back on the ancient farmhouse renovation. So I set this up, I can just about get it stuck on this steel there. Laser level, mark, measure down 65 to the top of the brick. There's a the level there, measure down 65 mil. Now I level up that and build up to that, that's our date and point to work to, 65 mil. Right, it's Thursday the 16th of Feb and we're back on the ancient farmhouse renovation. Uh, on my own today because Alex has got, um, it's got, um, it's got a scan today. So he, he can't eat so and then he scans in the middle of the day so on my own. Excuse the noise, I'll have to talk close to the camera. So I set this up, I can just about get it stuck on this steel there. Um, I tried to do it on the pole, but because the pole's round, it's not stable enough. So I've got all that line here. Let's make that there. So I can just about make it out this end. I'm not going to be able to see it on camera, just see it on the phone with him. You see it there? So basically, there's our line, which I will mark with a pencil. It. It's just about, it's just basically transferring the levels down. So we've got sixty three mil down to the brick. Oh. Excuse the lousy filming. We need to transfer sixty three mil down on here which is just in a bad spot there so 
can do it here. Just anywhere we can light it. So let me put this camera somewhere. I can't put it on there, it's not stable enough. So that's it for now. I've got there's my mark, so I've got my laser level, mark measured down 65 to the top of the brick. There's the level there, measured down 65 mil. So now I level up that and build up to that, that's our dating point to work to 65 mil. Down. I hope that makes sense. Yeah, that's we wake up to that, that's our lintel height. Catch me. This is that um, foil bubble wrap stuff. The, the, the ends of the steel over here, you've probably seen on the video. And these cables, these cables are wrapped around the steel, so I've put that behind between the steel and the cables to protect them. And I've also covered up the end of the wall so we don't get the, the pad stones, so we don't get jump tracking through. I know it's a nine inch wall and that, but it's just belt and braces, so that's all sorted and protected. Yeah, just sort of show you that.
Close to the camera because I've got the mics on. Chase has kindly helped me in with that. Put it down to 2300. All bedded up nice. And all I have to do now is just tuck pointed across the top because that row of headers there, which are being held inside with echoes on the inside, and it's also held by the render. It's going nowhere that. A little bit of patching still on the end and the tuck points across the top. So I'm going to go and put another mix in. Yeah, I miss you, Alex. You, you, you're quite a lot faster at the mixes than I am. But anyway. And there we have it. It's a couple of hours later since I finished it, but the, um, these guys were approaching, so it was just too noisy. And uh, they were above there, so a bit dangerous as well, so I had to get out of there. But yeah, all in. I've, I've stripped this scaffold because it's not needed anymore. I'm finished with that. That's all stripped out of the way because that was on this level. So there we have it. All built up, that's been tied in with the Bluebird tie into the existing. In nice and level, all top pointed solid under them headers. So, yeah. Oh, right. There we go. So, very impressed with that laser level. That made things a lot simpler than trying to put a straight edge across. Yeah, it took me, it took me minutes and it's lucky having the steel to uh, put the magnetic bracket on. It wasn't, wasn't any good in the round poles, but so it's done the job. So I think we're back here tomorrow. So tomorrow is, well, we don't need to prop anything tomorrow because this is all, this all gone off. So tomorrow is whip this out and take two more courses of brick out back up to the headers again and put, take this and raise it up to behind this because it's an internal um, lintel and it's not a normal that's just going to reuse this piece of timber so I think we're going to be doing that tomorrow I'm not sure if Alex will be with him tomorrow because he's got a blood test tomorrow uh, he's had a bit he's had a scan today so wish, wish him well I'm sure we'll let you know how we got on but yeah that's the finished job now just the inside to do now and then I'm not sure which lintel's next another little job to do is now the render's off yeah that old lintel above that old door. God, done, every opening's been messed with on this house. Everything. Look at that. So that needs coming out. I'm bricking up. That's staying in because it's it's, uh, it's fine. And then this render's staying on because it is like iron. You see how grey that is. That is super, super strong, that. And you can see what it's doing to the bricks trying to get it off. So I think they've given up on this stuff and they're going to leave this pebble dash on because it is solid. So that's it for today. We'll see you tomorrow.
Thank you.